Hi there, my name is Guru Vaidya and I'm going to be taking you through um, how to blur faces inside Premiere Pro uh, CC. Now if you're a news editor or you're doing documentary work, there are times when you need to blur the subject's face uh, or add a mosaic pattern like the one that I have here and I'm going to show you how to do this in Premiere Pro CC. Uh, the workflow remains the same for CS6 as well in case you're a CS6 user. So let's look at how to get this done. So let me start this from scratch. So I'm going to take my video here, bring it onto the timeline. Once I have to the timeline, now the first thing I need to do is I need to create an adjustment layer. So I'm going to come down here and I'm going to create a new adjustment layer. Width and height seems okay. And I'm going to click drag this guy onto V2 on my timeline. Now to this adjustment layer, I'm then going to come down to effects and add the mosaic uh, effect. So I'm going to click drag that there. That obviously is way too huge. So let's uh, scale those down by increasing the number of blocks, horizontal blocks, maybe 70 and keep the vertical maybe 50 or something of that sort. There you go. Um, so now the problem is we've got this effect applied to the entire image uh, or the entire sequence and what I'd like to do is confine it to just his face. Now the way that you do that is you would need to create a mask. Uh, and the way that you create a mask in Premiere is you come down to the new, uh, new sequence uh, option right here and you select a title. We'll call this mask for face. Say OK to that and that opens up the titler. Now in the titler, you've got a bunch of these tools here which can be used for creating a mask. So let's say I, I select that uh, circle there and uh, maybe I'll just roughly scale it up to the size of his face. And once I have something that looks OK, I'm going to close the, the titler. So, and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to select that title that we just created and I'm going to click drag it onto the video 3 layer on my uh, video, video 3 track on my timeline. And so I have my mask here, I've got my adjustment layer and I've got the footage. Now the final thing that needs to be done here is you need to come down to effects and you need to look for something called the track mat key. Uh, so click drag the track mat key onto the adjustment layer and in the track mat key, uh, one of the options that you have here, the most important one, is to pick which layer your mask is on or your mat is on. So obviously I've got it on video layer 3, so you want to select that. And now what you'll notice is, uh, you'll notice that the mask is confined to just his face. And uh, I'm sorry, the effect is confined to just his face and that's, that's how you go about doing this. So I've added a Gaussian blur here to the mat here so that... Uh, we have uh, a soft edge to the mat, but this is how you go about doing it. Uh, if you if you if you if you want to replace the mosaic with uh, a simple blur, you could do that as well. Just click drag the Gaussian blur onto the uh, onto the adjustment layer, and you can turn off the mosaic and say, okay, I just want to blur this by a certain value, and you can take that up and blur his face uh, that way as well. So you've got both the options that you could go with. So I hope this was useful. Thanks for watching.